Hey everyone, Joe here. Welcome to part 15, the final part of the Pro Tools first course. In this part, we're gonna be going over what you've learned in the course. I'm gonna be sharing with you some materials and resources so, you, so that you can further your learning as you go on to use the software. First of all, if you followed this course right from the beginning, then well done. You can have a full, well-rounded knowledge of Pro Tools first. The learning does not stop here. And I'm sure that your skills are gonna be going from strength to strength as you use the software more. You've learned how to get Pro Tools first installed and set up. You've learned how to record your first tracks, you've learned your way around the audio interface and how to edit and mix and then export your audio as well. You should hopefully no longer be overwhelmed by the options available in Pro Tools first and you should have the skills to do just about any of the basic tasks. And if you do decide to upgrade to the full version of Pro Tools in the future, you'll be off to a flying start. Now I just want to share a couple of things with you that can help you to continue your learning further. Firstly, I left a link in the description to where you can download a PDF of the essential Pro Tools first shortcuts. It goes through all of the keyboard shortcuts that I feel will be the most essential for you for speeding up your workflow and getting more done quicker. I've designed it so that you can download it and check it at a glance and I've added a few extra tips in there, um, just my, my suggestions on how to use these and when to use them. In addition, I've also put together a Pro Tools First quiz that you can do. You'll, if you click on the link, you'll also get access to that as well. It's a bunch of questions going through all different aspects of Pro Tools First. It's just a bit of fun, but it's good to reinforce your learning and see which areas that you might still be a little bit unsure on you might want to go back and check those videos again. But if you are still unsure on anything at all and you, and you feel the videos don't cover it, just let me know in the comments section below. I can always add more content to this. I can always reply to your comments directly and try and help out as well. So to finish off, I just want to say thank you so much for joining me on the course. I'm not going anywhere. I re release a video at least once a week to this channel every Tuesday. Um, we go over editing, recording, mixing, um, so that you can boost your skills further. So subscribe if you haven't already and let me know in the comments section below what your results to that quiz were uh, if you take it and also if you've been working on something in Pro Tools first, if you've got a project finish and finish, then leave a link in the description. It'd be great to hear some of your work. And as always, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time.